the thing that has impressed me most is the is how uh, deeply founded the strategy and the vision uh, is in the kids. I mean, no matter who you talk to, uh, how old they are, uh, in, in in what situation, they always kind of uh, start talking about something and then can see it uh, integrated in the vision somehow. So, so it's really impressive how how well built the foundation of, of what you want to do and how you want to do it is uh, that has impressed me the most and and uh, secondly the discipline i mean uh, so many disciplined teenagers it's unbelievable in the academy yesterday to see the give back it was uh, some of the, it was one of the best experiences i ever had it, it, it was so so good to see that the, the kids that have been given a chance uh, still want to to say a kind of thank you to to the community around them I think that the, the idea of, of, of letting things grow slowly is the absolute right idea, and uh, especially uh, both here and, and, and with the FCN in Denmark, you, you don't have the money for the quick success, so you have to build it. The future looks bright. I think it's very, uh, and the future for FCN is very bright. Uh, it seems like uh, working together is a perfect idea, and uh, that uh, the academy can benefit from FCN, and FCN can benefit from the academy. So it, it looks like something who will grow even stronger and bigger. I think that the more you see this, uh, the more you like it. It grows on you, it really does, and uh, it seems so genuine. One, two, three, let's go! Come on, Actually, when you come to a place like this, uh, you have the sense that it uh, it matters. What struck me the most when I came here was talking to the, the children, starting from nine years and up. Uh, I'm 50 years old and actually they teach me and told me about the values that they have identified and how they live their lives here. And I really have something to go home with. Even though 50 years old, the social responsibilities in these kids struck me the most. At first I thought, wow, these kids have learned their lesson. This looks like excuse me, brainwash, <laughs> because there was so much here. Then you get to talk to the, to the kids, you get to know them, and you find out, wow, this goes actually deep. They, they mean it, they understand it. It's not just words they learned. Having 13-year-olds uh, being as mature as an 18-year-old and uh, being so aware of where life is going to take you, how you're going to get to your, uh, how you're going to fulfill your dreams. This one motivates me a lot. Your attitude, not your attitude, simply will determine your attitude. Having Tom as a founder of everything and the chairman of FC Nordsjælland, that's, that's good because you have to be really keen on what you do to make it work in a strategy over years. That's the philosophy that makes uh, the right to dream idea strong because it's so deep into Tom and so deep into Casper Juhlmann back in FC Nordsjælland and the people there. Uh, so I think the, the integration into the leading uh, persons in this project is the strength of it, uh, and that's that that makes it um, uh, that highs the 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 chances uh, of, uh, of of actually making success out of it.